Hey guys, what's up? Modzella here and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you a must-have and a very inexpensive mod and install for your 3rd gen Toyota Tacoma, which is the 4 LED grill lights or the Raptor lights. I apologize, but I got ahead of myself and went ahead and installed the lights and I wish I had done a step-by-step -step, uh, instructional video, but there are already a lot of uh, uh, very comprehensive instructional videos out there for this. So instead, I'm just going to point out a few things that I did differently uh, for the lights and uh, let's get to it. So there you have it already installed. As usual, I'll be posting uh, the links of the product down below. So go ahead and check them out. And uh, as I mentioned, this is very inexpensive. It cost me under $20 uh, to, to get it from AliExpress. Um, one thing to mention is that uh, these two in the middle uh, pop in perfectly as these are uh, retrofitted to, to fit perfectly in the slots. But for these outer ones, this one and this one, you have to, uh, let me just see if uh, I can pop that out quickly here for you. There you go. So what I had to do is use a Dremel to grind this side and the other side. So uh, that would allow it to slide and lock in perfectly there. And you have to do that on this side as well. But if you use these four in the middle, uh, the higher one, so that's uh, basically side by side by side, they uh, perfectly fit there. So you don't need to do any uh, uh, grinding, uh, but you can also do different uh, configurations of the lights like one, two, three, four, or one, two, three, or however may the, uh, however the case may be. But for me, I opted to to install them this way because it does make look the the truck look wider. So uh, as I mentioned, the only thing that I did differently here is I did not use the uh, the the fuse. Uh, cable that was supplied uh, by the manufacturer and I'm uh, so I'm posting right here um, these photos so these are basically the uh, 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 description and the uh, way the uh, package is going to come in uh, as mentioned the cable I did not have to use because I didn't want to uh, do the tapping into the fuse box and also uh, really the main reason reason was I wanted the uh, LED lights to come on when I start the engine uh, and uh, line that up with the DRL which is the day daytime running light so the way I did that was I hope you can see it here I basically looked for my date, daytime running light connection, which is this one over here, and took the red wire from the uh, LED harness and just basically tapped it into uh, the DRL LED uh, DRL red light. And uh, the black is pretty straightforward. Black wire just taps into a ground, which I uh, connected over there. So uh, that's it for connection. Um, um, the only thing that I really did is, you know, uh, wrap them up, wrap them up properly with the uh, tie wraps. Uh, make sure that they don't flap around when you're driving, and that is it. So let's go ahead and test this out. Okay, so let's go ahead and start her up. Just make sure. Let's make sure here that we are in the uh, off position. So there you have it, uh, we have the four LED lights on along with the daytime running light, the DRLs, and I think she looks good. So let's try it with the uh, headlights on, sorry, the uh, light switch on. So let's just put this to 
on. Let's see if we can see that there. And let's see what happens. So by doing that, now you see that the uh, the Raptor lights are on, the DRL is on, and also now the fog lights are on. So she's looking good. Let's see what happens when we turn the, uh, the switch, light switch, all the way to on. So all the way to on position oh sorry I turned it off so now that's all the way to the on position so that's when the uh, uh, headlights come on and uh, shuts down the LED grill lights. There you have it. So there you have it. Another pretty uh, straightforward and easy install from Mozilla. Hope you liked it and if this was helpful to you, please hit those like and subscribe buttons. And until the next video, for now, remember, if you can be anything, be nice.